Hey guys, KCOG back. Um, we're gonna meet over here at the temple entrance. So, crouching tiger temple temple entrance. This is uh, the second part to be able to get into. Oh, did I? I missed the whole chest. Wow. Look at that. Okay. Well, that's good. That's pretty good. But over to the right, before the temple, you'll see the pig. He needs a jade lotus. We have a bunch of those, so here you go. Okay, he's saying it's the right time, so we can go ahead and do the secret area. And I think we have what's required to unlock this now, too. So we can go ahead and unlock this. Just creates a little portal here. And what are the important things? Whoops. Is this guy. We really, really want this. It is the last one, I think. I think we already got stamina, we got mana just before, and now we got health. You're not done yet, but... So there's gonna be all these little fuckers. I suggest taking one out as fast as you can. I'll even use Pluck a Many on this one. Because one of them is a summon? There we go. One of them's down. There's a lot of these guys though, and they're little dickheads. Okay, let's not die here. Let's just get the big guy. Oh, both of them? Oh, that was dope. Okay. Two at a time! Anyways, they're a doozy. So I'd, I'd pull out all your stops for that one. I didn't use my spirit summon because they're pretty quick. But you'll get the Civet Sergeant. Kind of spooky, honestly. So, maximum health, got a new spirit, and I think this is just random yoga cores and whatnot. Nope, silk, okay. Anyway, so, oh, look at this. It's the back side of the secret area. Forgot that when that's, that pops out there. <clears throat> we didn't even open the door. That's kind of crazy. It's kind of crazy you can do that early. Anyways, get the bonfire and we're going to come into here. And we're gonna find Zhu Dog. Hmm. Okay. Can we? There we go. Mine eyes don't see the Dao from the. So this guy is very important <clears throat> because he's gonna be able to permanently upgrade stats. If you can give him cores, not yoga cores, it's, uh, god, what are they called? Mind cores, there you go. 
So, Celestial Medicine. What I recommend doing is maximum mana first. So, I'm going to be doing all five and maximum mana. So, this will permanently upgrade your mana. And we just did that by 50, which is huge. That's like another spell. Mind cores are going to drop off of, like, good bosses and stuff like that. We can do defense, I suppose. I'm just going to kind of keep saving them all up. This only levels up to 9. It's already at 5. So the big ones go to 9. These smaller ones go to 18, 12, and 36. So that's a lot of mind cores. That's so much. You can also make pretty decent... Uh, Med medicines too. You can take them back too if you want to get rid of them if you didn't like your uh, allocations I suppose. I'll go ahead and just buy that too. It's a formula for we'll just forever have it. Actually whoops oh well we could have sold we'll just save them we're doing good on decent on money so anyways do not go left here very important, do not go left. Do not step into the stand sandstorm yet. Instead, we're going to travel all the way back. And you're going to want to talk to this guy. Okay, that's all he has to say, but it's very important you meet him here. He will move, and you're going to get one of the best gourds in the game later, as long as you find him at each step. Look at the beautiful Buddhas. And let's get our spark. And we have a bunch. And we can go ahead and just warp back. I know, I missed the plant. <clears throat> and we're going to now travel back to the Rockrest Flat. So as long as you met the boar at the church, you'll be able to queue a boss fight here. And we're going to go into the secret area. The secret area isn't very big, but it is necessary for some of the se secret stuff ahead. Ditch those two fools. Make your way over here, and there's just going to be this boar guy standing here. Yeah, that's some really good damage, honestly. He's kind of, he is tricky. He's a tricky boss. But that's some good damage. I would just use out all your stops. You're going to, uh... Oops. Oh god, can we not die? We died anyways. Wow. I forgot about his little area of effect thing. <laughs> He's usually not a problem. I was going to transform, but uh, here we are. Here we are. Okay. Well, that's embarrassing. Beating some hard bosses first try, and then we lose to little piggy.
Oops. All right, let's try that again. Try this again. Get our mana back. I do not like that move. There we go. One more immobilize to do the trick for a full uh There we go. Alright. <clears throat> so we're gonna get the boar hat for our troubles. And he's going going to unlock the secret area. And we forgot to level up again. Anyways, right, so let's go ahead and go in. There's gonna be a bunch of cutscenes, I don't wanna ruin it, so. Watch the cutscenes. Okay. <clears throat> it's a long loading. They are cool cutscenes. I'm on a crunch for time though. Let's not miss the shrine. We're already at full. Wait, what was that? Make venisons, right. We unlocked a new one. So this guy isn't as bad as the boar, in my opinion. <clears throat> so, try and get a perfect dodge as you can. I mean, he just doesn't want to... Pretty easy to dodge. So we'll do that. We'll get our spirit out. We can even transform if I'll let me. <laughs> As I said, he was easy, but he wouldn't let me transform. Oh my god. We're just we're struggling today. He's really easy too. I mean we're doing the damage. He just uh <laughs> for the life of me, we cannot pop the summon. It does take a little bit to do, so like you have to be doing no actions and not getting hit. <sighs> Clearly. Okay. Okay, guy. I like how a full thing just broke his whole ass uh, thing.
And, uh, I can probably just keep doing this little combo here. Let's go ahead and transform this time. Not make the same mistake. And that's it for him. Man, he was really weak to fire. That was good. It was good to know. So, watch the cutscene. Brave soul, why not use this might to aid my king's good deed? Our king, Yahweh, the king of the truth. Worry not. <clears throat> Just exhaust his dialogue. I think that's all he gives you is the curio, but. Yep. yep, that's it. This curio is really good, by the way. Successful, successful hits with light attack combo moderately increases attack for a short duration. It's pretty good. It's extra damage. Defense is good too. Yes, Kingdom of Sahi Sahali. Alright, before you hit the shrine, run up here and don't miss this chest. We're gonna get our first knot of voidness. And something to sell. I think that's all that does. You just sell it. <coughs> Excuse me. Walked up, talked to the king. I did. And now it's secret boss fight time. And I can't skip this part. Show me what you. Show me your moves. Aid me with this. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Big desert for this boss fight. So you kind of want to dodge right before he... Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> oh god. You want to dodge right before he falls on you. It's kind of hard, but... Oops. This boss was like... I must feel like a gimmick boss a little bit.
so after a while, he's gonna run away again. You can clan step if you want to. Dodging is not that bad, just make sure you're at full. That's what I recommend. And he still got us. Oh god. Make sure you're at close to full or full. This one should be the big lunge. There it is. There we go, perfect dodge. Move or die, he says. There we go, another perfect dodge. Okay, homie's gonna come help the cause now. That's why I say it's kind of a gimmick boss because... Oh my god. <clears throat> so we just gotta run up here and we're gonna collect the big Buddha eye. After that's done, oh my god. He joins us, and the, the just survive at this point. See the bosses, <laughs> our buddy's even taking him on by himself. You could honestly just let him. He does a lot of damage too, it's pretty good. Anyways, <clears throat> that is it. Watch it on your own, but you're going to get a secret piece of gear for completing this. Oh my god. On the folks' behalf, I thank you. Okay, with that being said, that is the secret boss. And you're also going to get the Wind Tamer, which is huge for this next boss fight. So I highly recommend you get it. It's very good. It says it's highly effective against certain enemies. Yeah, anyways, it's going to be really good uh, at the end. But it's also going to slightly increase damage reduction, which is crazy. Anyways... That's it for this episode. I guess I gotta do stuff, so I'll see you guys in the next one. Later, y'all.